It's the fear of schoolboys across the English-speaking world to be asked by other schoolboys one simple question. What is the capital of Thailand? Of course, the answer is Bangkok, which when told would result in a bang in the, well, you know. However, if this question were to be asked by schoolboys in the nation of Thailand itself, then thankfully the end result would be less painful, as Bangkok isn't called Bangkok in Thai. As in Thai, the city is called Krung Thep Mahanakon, but is often simply shortened to just Krung Thep. And if you thought that first name of Krung Thep Mahanakon was long, then this four-word name for the city is actually a shortened version of the city's four-word ceremonial name, a name that I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce, but luckily others on the internet have. For now, we will just stick with Krung Tep. So why is Krung Tep named Bangkok in the English-speaking world? Despite Bangkok becoming the city's exonym, it's actually the older name of the two. We don't know exactly what the name Bangkok means, but we have a few ideas. One idea is that the name derives from the Thai word Bang, which means a village on a stream, with the Kok part coming from Ko, meaning island, in reference to the city's watery surroundings. Another idea is that it comes from the Thai Bang, which means a place, and the Thai Gok, which means olives, so the name means a place with olives. So despite these different ideas with its etymology, we can presume the name came from the fact that the city was founded on land near water and olive trees. And it's from this name of Bangkok where we can see the city's proper pronunciation. In English, we put the G sound at the end of the first syllable, hence why it sounds so rude. But if this name were to be said in Thai, the G sound actually goes at the start of the second syllable, more Bangkok than Bangkok. Still, no one told me this when I was in school rolling around in pain. The city of Bangkok, however, hasn't always been the capital of Thailand. In fact, it's the fourth capital of the nation. Before Bangkok was established as the capital, there was Sukhothai, Ayutthaya, and Thonburi. It was when King Rama I moved the capital to Bangkok in 1782, he changed the name to Krung Tep, with this name meaning City of Angels. And while I couldn't find out exactly why they named this city after angels, it means that LA isn't the only city of angels on our planet. Nonetheless, this name cemented itself in Thailand, while the older name of Bangkok remained in the English-speaking world. But what about that full name, which I shan't even attempt to say? Well, in English, this ceremonial name means the city of angels, the great city, the residence of the Emerald Buddha, the impregnable city of Ayutthaya, of God Indra, the grand capital of the world endowed with nine precious gems, the happy city, abounding in an enormous royal palace that resembles the heavenly abode where reigns the reincarnated God, a city given by Indra and built by Vishnu Khan. And according to the Guinness World Records, this is the longest name for a place in the world, though other sources list this place in New Zealand as having the longest name, but I think that's more for just a one word place as opposed to Bangkok's full name, which is multiple words. Bangkok was suggested by Jacob Berg, and thanks to their suggestion, they will now be honoured as Name Explained's patron saint of Bangkok. Do you have a good idea for somewhere that's name could be covered in a Name Explained video? If so, then please consider donating on Patreon. Just $1 a month helps keep the channel running and earns you a weekly chance to suggest somewhere to be turned into a video and you too could be a Name Explain Patreon saint. Thank you to all my patrons who support Name Explain on a monthly basis. Name Explain depends on small monthly donations from fans like you to help keep the channel running. Just a small amount of $2 a month helps out in a huge way, grants you patron exclusive Name Explain extras and gets your name here with all these awesome people. Thank you.